Meanwhile, this man's looking to be top of the tree. Yet again. Graham Chardon, the world number three. The World Cup holder in the FEI Driving World Cup. The winner from Geneva. Second last time in London. He didn't come out this season until Geneva. This is only his third outing of the year. What is he able to do? Final conversations complete there with uh, Leanne on the back as the midstep with uh, Quince leaning low because they know they've got a little bit in hand. They can play a little bit safe because both of the early drives picking up penalties. Graham Shardot, though, is certainly not going to be yet going slowly from start to finish here, is he? What a wonderful picture. Team really working together as they pull, and then he leans back. He's got that magical touch just to bring the horses back, slow the pace down, start the turn into the marathon. Ready through B. able to keep them cantering gently along now back into the trot because he knows this is the tight pit slip slide your way through and at the moment he's going to come out of here with one more gate to go now has he done it yes he has and he's still clear is Bram Chardon for the Netherlands looks down judges the turn perfectly the sand flies sideways It's a masterful performance so far. Where is he on the split time? Oh, nine seconds. So far, this is a textbook performance from Bram Shadow. Now to the twists and turns of the magic roundabout in the middle. Round and round the merry-go-round. Then it releases you. And now there's just these final two gates. This is quite some drive from the reigning FEI driving World Cup champion. That's the final gate. What does he do going through the shortcut towards the end? He has picked up four, but it's not going to make any difference at all tonight because for the second time this season, Graham Chardon wins this time in Mechlin on the FEI driving World Cup foot circuit. He won in Geneva and he's done it again here in Mechlin tonight. What a superb round of driving that was.